My name is Justin Oldacre. I'm the owner of By Your Side Senior Care. By Your Side is a non-medical in-home care agency. We help people stay home where they prefer to stay. What gets me up in the morning is providing care for our seniors that they normally don't get. Um, also, I'm just passionate about providing jobs. There's, we employ people who didn't have another career to go. They were single moms. Um, we're providing a service that's desperately needed in the community. This is Edith. Edith lives alone here in Tucson. She has one daughter that lives in Chicago. Last Christmas, Edith's daughter was visiting her and noticed some things were a little bit off with her mom. When asked her, when Edith's daughter asked, is everything okay? What did Edith say? Yes, everything's just fine, don't worry about it. Six months later, Edith ended up in the hospital. Now this is due to, she missed a couple medications, got a little dizzy, had a fall. This scenario plays out across America every single day. Now solutions for Edith, she needs to go into a nursing home, large assisted living home, a small care home, or have private care come in. Now, every single one of us knows an Edith, you are an Edith, or one day you're gonna be an Edith, just like me. 10,000 Americans are turning 65 every single day. 90% of all seniors who get care is from a non-pay care caregiver. That means family. 37% of all adults over 65 are <laughs> living alone. My name is Justin Oldacre. I'm the owner of By Your Side Senior Care. And we've been providing care here in Tucson since 2008 with my lovely wife, Laura. Now, we believe we have a better solution for Edith and everyone else out there. It's called Smart Aging at Home. Now, Smart Aging uses very small, um, intrusive, um, non-intrusive sensors throughout the home to report intelligent information to you and your family so you can make smart decisions about your care. How some of that works. Pressure sensors, like on a bed or on a couch. Did mom get a good night's sleep? Did she not? These are important information. And you need to know this information so you can prevent that fall or other symptoms. Motion sensors throughout the home. Is your mom being active in the home? Is she doing the things that are normal in an everyday home? Also, open and close sensors. Did Edith go into or your mom go into a fridge? Did she make a meal? Did she open the, cu uh, the cupboards? Um, did she take her medications? How many times she's been to the bathroom? Those are important informations when it comes to our seniors. How it works. When these sensors are in your home, what they do is record what's normal. What's a normal day in your home? From there, when a sensor gets triggered, outside of what's normal, an alert goes out. Alert, mom is not taking her medications today. So we can give her a call saying, hey, you forgot to take your meds, can you do that? And then the sensor will go off and we know she did. Now, if we're not able to get a hold of her, we can call family to go check on mom. Or we can have neighbors, whoever is in your circle of trust. Or a senior aide or a caregiver can come to your home and, and check on mom. Now, instead of these solutions that are going to drain a life savings in a matter of years, we can deliver this for $99 a month. Our customer type is me and you, and they are the people who are um, working professionals. They're in the age group of the late 40s to mid 60s. They um, have broadband and use a smartphone every single day. We have identified that 44 million Americans have parents that are over the age 75. Of that, those have been surveyed, 21% say, my parents need some kind of help and currently are not getting it. That brings us down to 9 million. 
5 million fits our customer type. Now we're going to go after one half of 1% of that market. And what that translates into is 30 million in annual revenue back into the Tucson economy. Now the, the options you have out there is to do nothing, which a lot of people do. Also, we have the savings um, eliminator right there, and also wearables. Now wearables, they, they don't solve any of the problems. They don't let you know if she got a good night's sleep. They, don't, they don't, do not let you know if she's had a meal. And also, you've seen the commercials. Help, I've fallen and I can't get up. Who wants to be associated wearing that around town? No one does. So we have a better solution. Smart aging at home can solve these problems at, at a fraction of the cost. Now, our go-to-market strategy, it's very simple. We're going to go at, after that direct consumer. And that equals the $30 million in annual revenue, that one-half, 1%. One but after that, we're going to go after industry partners. Industry partners are assisted living homes, like, like mine, um, care homes. Um, there's tens of thousands across America that can integrate this very easily into their platform and in their marketing strategy then we can go after Medicare and insurance. Because that same savings that, that Edith can get by using the system, so can insurance companies and Medicare and government programs. We have surveyed our customers and their parents, and of those interviews, 72% want this in their home now. What does this mean for Tucson? It means high paying jobs. Um, it also means the development of new technologies here locally. We also going to have the monitoring center here locally also. It means lots of jobs, which in turn means millions back into our economy every single year. What I need from the community, this is a brand new idea. The technology exists. Um, we just need to bring it to market, and we need um, software develop it, de developers and also engineers. Now, Tucson has always been a place where people come to age. We can make Tucson a leader in aging technology. Thank you.